at the 2013 Portfolio Tasting for Profile Wine Group, and right now I'm speaking to Natalie Bonham. You have some of Spain's most interesting wines here at the table, but really what I want to talk about is your own wine, Bonham. So please tell me about it. My own wine, Bonham. I like that. <laughs> Uh, we have two wines. I make uh, two wines with two great winemakers. One from Valencia, called El Bonhomme, which is my family name. I was born with it, for the best and for the worst. And then the second one is El Petit Bonhomme, made from Jumilla. Jumilla, which is in the south of Spain, is same, uh, not very far from Valencia. So two wines, two red wines. What's the winemaking philosophy for, for your company? Giggles. <laughs> I like that. That's a good philosophy. That's great. That's all we do, <laughs> really. Just have a laugh. Yeah, and don't take yourself seriously. That's I, all. <laughs> I love that. Well, it's proving to be quite successful because you have one of the busiest tables here at the event today. Now you That's because of Casey. Oh, <laughs> because wow. she's very pretty. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Um, now, you also have another very interesting wine here from Spain, and that's from Pingus. So yeah. can you tell us what the connection is, please? Well, the wine we've got was very, very fortunate. Uh, for a file, I opened a few bottles of Flor de Pingus, which is from Domino de Pingus, which is uh, one of the iconic wine of Spain, um, from Ribera del Duero. Um, and we normally never open bottles because just simply we do not have any. We're a very exclusive winery and very small production and a lot of demand. So you're very fortunate tonight to have uh, to be able to, to taste a flower because 2010, which is quite a vintage or so. So good, good. <laughs> 